No fair, you got multiple lightsabers! What the heck, man? <laughs> Look at me, I'm a little spider. Oh, <laughs> the itsy bitsy grievance the went up the water spout. Uh. He creepily ran along the little floor. That's disturbing on so many levels. <laughs>what's happening gamers welcome back to the k-wings let's plays channel and it's time for another star wars battlefront 2 versus, versus. today's yeah. fan request is master kenobi versus <laughs> general grievous yeah. who has some grievances with <laughs> obi-wan in the comment section below tell us your favorite sith lord and why they're your favorite, favorite. I hope this isn't anything too unseemly. Well, it's K-Wing's Let's Play. Sorry, Obi-Wan. This will be child's play. It is very the unseemly. Oh, no, not this level. We hate this level. It's the cloning factory. We can no. never find each other, like, ever. So anyway, welcome back to K-Wing's Let's Plays. We're the K-Wings, a husband and wife that love playing games together and causing galactic mischief. And this is the new Obi-Wan Kenobi and General Grievous DLC for Star Wars Battlefront 2. So we literally re-downloaded uh, re this game and we're destroying each other in the Star Wars universe once again because Amber and I are great big Star Wars fans, which people like Ryan Johnson and Disney hate us because we are classic Star Wars fans. Yeah. <laughs> we actually like storytelling and characters not to be destroyed just for the sake of shock value. <laughs> yeah. So we are true Star Wars fans. We don't like them to be destroyed randomly like in a K-drama where they just fall down the stairs. That's what happened to Luke Skywalker if you think about it, you know? He was just like, like, oh, everything's cool. I'm here but... one second, and then <laughs> it's like, not anymore. It's like, what? I need more for force I powers than I have in my little force power gauge? Well, I guess I'm gone. I mean, they had such a great opportunity where they could have had to uh, fight Kylo Ren on that planet and take down, like, most of his stuff, but nope. Okay, that's terrifying. Uh, force push! It didn't work! I'm for you. What the? <laughs> Get him, my minion! Shoot him! Yeah, you're not doing so well, are you? Ow, you I don't feel a, so good, do you? I have a headache. Bye bye. It kind of sounds like a doll, like a little bit. Like I am coming for you. I am. Wait, I did you just call General Creepus a doll? -like? You will be destroyed. No, 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 you no, no, will no, no. Be destroyed. No, no. Dalek sounds like this. It doesn't <laughs> sound like General Grievous with lightsabers. Obi Wan Kenobi, you will be exterminated. <laughs> yeah, see, no, it doesn't. He has okay. like kind of like if Bane got punched in the throat too many times, <laughs> and like he had like hot sauce, and then he tried to speak. That is General Grievous's voice box. Oh my god. See, that's that's how that works. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah. Why is it they need to add radar? A radar would make this like more interesting because you could always find people. It's like half the time you just run around like, oh, I'm a Jedi that's going to attack people, but how are there 60 troops left? I haven't gotten to do anything. All our troops are doing stuff. I am totally stuck. I think it's best if you follow your troops, that's how you get to the action. Otherwise, yeah, the you get lost. Know where they are. All right, I'm following this guy. The troops this guy, he knows what's up. He knows what's up. Yeah! I got a kill. Man, Don't they move kill. fast. That's great, kid. Don't get cocky. Force push. Dang it! Oh my gosh. Oh, it's raining out here. It is raining. It's kind of pretty outside. You, you, you kind of mentioned that. Wait, what? 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 Go down, fool. It's got shiny floors in the rain, too. I don't understand how General Grievous, if he's a bad guy, why he has a blue and a green lightsaber. You forgot about General Grievous already? When he kills Jedis, he takes their weapons as a trophy. Oh. So he has a lot of lightsabers. 
Wow. Yeah, he does it to taunt like Obi Wan and other Jedi's too, because when they see their fallen friends' lightsabers, it's like a mental game. Wow. Like, I butchered your friends, and you're next. So it's like, you know, mind games. But couldn't somebody just go into somebody's house and steal their lightsaber? Like, they wouldn't have to destroy them. I know, but the fact that the Jedi's know that he is a Jedi Slayer... Oh, yeah. Force push! Oh, come on! No! What the heck? Come on! I have my little spider move thing that I do across the ground. I don't care about your spider move. It's kind of freaky if you think about it. I am anxious to start. We gotta get revenge, Obi-Wan. Can't get beat by forearms there. Who are you calling forearms? Uh... You will be destroyed. Delete, delete. My question is, why did it take almost a year to get Obi-Wan and General Grievous in this game? I mean, what, I what was EA doing before then? Waiting for enough Oh, <laughs> Savage Amber! <laughs> I just had a quiet uh, day. Yeah, they're great. They, they still like us, I think. You know now. <laughs> <laughs> the truth shall set you free. Where is everybody? Where's my stupid Republic guy so I can find out where people? I guess I'll just try to go down, down the main corridors. Ow! What just happened? Yeah, I'm gonna try to stay with my troops. I think it's the best course of action. Okay. Uh-oh. 50 oh troops God. remaining for me. That's not good. I guess it is easier to follow your troops and to... And just run around randomly, yeah. Whee! Where did the guy go? They destroyed my dude. Well, I mean, that's the whole point of the game. It's not they're gonna sit down and have tea and, you know, discuss tea current Lord. events. That could be a war, though, depending on what topic you bring up. There is no passion, there is Volute. There is no what? There is only Volute? What? I didn't get it that. Alright. There's only... Fall, fool! Alright. Mm. I know you're around here, I can smell you. I can also smell you, except for I'm a robot, so I don't really have well, a Well, Amber, you're going too far. When it goes, Thank uh... You. Colored like or not colored like that, then you know you're in a problem. Yep. You know things are about to be very, very bad. Ski. troops are coming. Hey, chill, dude. Chillax. It dices. Relax, it slices, so. and you're done. -o. You are done. -o. Where are you? I'm just like destroying your underlings. It's not really. Quite as fun as hitting you with lightsabers. Aww, you miss hitting me with lightsabers? I'm touched. Yeah, I'm, I'm just mowing down your peeps, so I mean... Mowing down my... Wait, what are you doing? You're mowing down my peeps? Yep. No way. I'm calling you out, Grievous. I, I have grievances to discuss with you. I have, I have grievances with you. I just mowed down one of your... No, you didn't. He's still there. Oh. He's stronger than you think. Stronger than you See, this is where stormtroopers learn how to not fight very well. No fair! You got multiple lightsabers! What the heck, man? <laughs> Look at me, I'm a little spider. Oh, <laughs> the itsy bitsy grievous went up the water spout. Uh. He creepily ran along the little floor. That's disturbing on so many <laughs> levels. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Do you know, again. like, it reminds me of Force Bush? Ah. Yes! What happened? I killed you! How did you kill me? You should take all my lightsabers. That's what somebody should do if they'd slaughter General Grievous. I think they did take... He took his lightsabers back from his fallen friends or something. That's awesome. Because Obi-Wan was the one to defeat him. Wait, Obi-Wan was the one to defeat General Grievous? Yep. How did I not remember that? Uh... Don't it, talk about it! It happened at the beginning of the... Oh, uh, Revenge Clone of the Wars. Sith. No. What? Revenge of the Sith has, like, so much time skip. Like... Oh. Yeah. There's like a, a massive time skip. That's why they made the Clone Wars uh, TV show, is to fill in the gaps of a bunch of stuff that happened. Oh, wow. Yeah. 
Well, now that I know more about him, it's like, okay, I'm glad that he was taken down. I thought he was just some weird robot that they used. Obi-Wan use. used the force to crush his chest where his organs were. Whoa, wait, he has organs? I'm so confused. Yeah, he's a alien creature. Ah! Oh, I thought he was like a robot. Go away! What did you just do? I just hit you. It sliced oh my, it's no, nice. no, 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 no! It makes mince meat out of. Ah! I got you! I got you again, Did fool! You just crush my organs? No, I, I diced and sliced you with my Turbo Ginsu saber. It's fun. So, wait, General Grievous is an alien, not a robot. Yeah, he's. A, he's basically like what happened to Vader, except alien. So, I mean, he got stuffed inside of a robotic suit, if you think about it. Oh, I got it. Yeah, I didn't... I guess Obi-Wan didn't even know he was an alien until after he, like, crushed his chest and the guy had problems breathing. And he was like, wait a second! Force powers! <laughs> it's a really cool fight, though. It's at the very beginning of, a, uh, Or, or... Yeah. yeah. Kind of the beginning of Revenge of the Sith. Maybe eventually I'll... Oh. In 10 or 20 years when they make movies that are even worse. Oh my gosh, I just thought of what we should do for our K-Wing movie stuff. We should, oh my we should make fun of the prequels. Oh Dang it! Oh my gosh, Luke, we're gonna get so much hate for that. I can't, I can't contain my rage for I know, long. that's why it would be so I good. I can't contain it. It's just that she ruins the whole movie. And you would be so interested in doing commentary for it because oh you can't stand the prequels. Uh, I don't even remember. I think I blocked some of them out of my mind. I know, so then it would be the perfect thing for you to tell viewers how you think. Oh my gosh. I mean, people are paying you to do your commentary for that, so I mean... You know. They'd be paying to watch, like, but people love the prequels. They're like, oh, they're the Star Wars I grew up with. And I'm just like, I feel so bad for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, I really oh. think how we got, like, such a big following back in the day is because of your hate for the prequels. <laughs> you had, like, probably tens of thousands of haters that followed you. <laughs> but they're just so bad. And then you also had some people that they liked you and they were trying to convert you to a prequelist. And it just How never would that panned out. Unless I know. They changed the prequels to be good. <laughs> <laughs> the Savage Amber's back. Just play Star Wars. Oh my gosh. Oh. It's just like I grew up like thinking like, wow, Princess Leia is so cool. Her mom must have been so much more awesome than her. Cool, dude. <laughs> it was like, it was like, hello, Viceroy. <laughs> I have the paperwork you requested. I made a photocopy. Let's have a 10 hour New meeting to decide how much grain to give our citizens. Like, okay. <laughs> like, how is this a cool princess? Ah! I got you. Bye bye. Oh my gosh. I had the high ground. Yeah, you did. Both in this argument and in my taste I for movies. With my every motor. Uh... That's why I can't believe that, uh, you know, the girl who played Padme, how she actually got a job after that movie, because it was just so bad. It was who, like, who played her again? <sighs> Natalie Portman. Oh, no. Natalie Portman, and then what's his name? Found you! What's her name played, uh, her double? Unfortunately. So I'm actually mad at both of them, because the one lady is actually a good actress. Who? Kristen Dunst? No. I, I don't really know if Chris, Chris Nance is like the actress. I'm talking about... The, the girl who played, um... You know, in the Pirates of the Caribbean. What's her name? Oh my gosh. I can't remember what her name is. She played Kate Blanchett? No. No. Um, I don't like Kate Blanchett. She's terrible. What's her name? What's her name? What's her name? Um, what was her character in Pirates of the Caribbean? Then that would help. Mm, lady with the big dress. That's right. You can't even remember the name of the character. <laughs> Let's see. There was Will Turner and Elizabeth Swan. Yeah. Elizabeth played Swan. by Christy Brealy. No. No. Um. Uh. Oh, what's what's her name? My gosh. I can't remember. Maybe I'll get my. It's phone. a weird name. No, no, it's not a weird name. She it's, also um, played uh, the love interest in uh in that thing with um 
This will be child no hiding Oh my gosh, Pride and Scott Prejudice. She played. Uh, I've never seen Pride and Prejudice. Oh my gosh. Like. You could watch it with me, but it's a girl. I mean, I don't know if it's a girly movie, but it's a. You know. It's Gosh, old. for the life of me, I can't remember the. Ah! I loved her in Pride and Prejudice. I actually like her better in that than Pirates of the Caribbean. Really I good. love the Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, I love, the love the Pirates of the Caribbean too. There's something else going on here. I'm just. I cannot remember what her name is. So. All I know is she's got a very small frame. She always plays really dramatic actresses, and she plays dramatic actresses. <laughs> she plays That's dramatic. That's talent. She plays dramatic roles. I play dramatic actresses. She's a brunette. I don't know. Anyway, she played the double of Natalie Portman's character. Mm. Like she had to be had me. Well, Natalie Portman technically was. Queen Amidala, but in reality, Queen Amidala pretended she was Padme for most of the movie, so the person who was in the suit of Queen Amidala was actually... Dang it. <sighs> okay, you're gonna hate this. Kira Knightley. Yeah, Kira Knightley. There you go. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Kira Knightley and, uh, played Padme, and the other person played, um, Natalie Portman played Queen Amidala. I thought you were gonna say, Kira Knightley played, played someone, and then Natalie Portman played Natalie Portman. But I'm kind of mad at both of them because Kira Knightley is actually a good actress. So why did she also do the terrible Queen of Doll voice? Like, wait, wasn't she also in the Marvel Thor movies? Natalie Portman. Yes, that, that's why I hated. That's why. I, that's why I hated those movies, and she ruined those as well because it's just like. Uh oh. I I couldn't I couldn't bear to see her in another movie. Like it just <laughs> she ruined everything for so me. So Amber became. See, this is why if you took one of those Star Wars self attestment things, you would be seen as a Sith Lord. But she ruined it. She should be deleted out of the film. I would rather have Did you know that no Jedi's time. don't have emotions, only Sith Lords? Wow, that's weird. Jedi's have, like, closed themselves off to emotions. Yeah, I mean, that's I. That's why Luke Skywalker's kind of a failed Jedi, but also why he changed Jedi stuff. Oh. Uh, Dang it, how? I am. Because you have multiple lightsabers? What the heck? What do you expect? I'm amazing. No. Just Are you grieving for Yeah, I'm, I'm grieving for that. That was that was not Am cool. Am I making you grieve? Are you grieving for your friends? I have lost the lead! No! <laughs> no, that's not happening. But I just didn't understand. Like, she said, oh, we both had to do a monotone. Like, when Kira Knightley was to be interviewed for that role. She said that they were both required to do a monotone voice because that way they could mimic each other. It's like, you're saying you both had to act terribly. <laughs> it's like, that oh my God. director should be fired and never, like, whoever decided that voice would be never done. No, come on! What the heck? This is bad, I'm gonna lose. No, I got shot down by one of your troopers, Luke. Good job, trooper! Oh, I... My gosh. Oh, man, this is so close. Seven to four. I'm sure... I think that was one of... Like, Kira Knightley, actually... I thought that was one of her earlier roles. She actually got good at acting after that, which is more than I can see from the other person. Amber, we're tied. Uh, this is the closest we've gotten in, in a I'm long really, I'm time. I'm channeling my... You know that sometimes when I channel my anger, I actually do better at stuff? Like, so, I remember I was at a job one time and people criticized me a lot of my job. That was when I was at the, I was that, uh, per receptionist at that, uh, um, what is that, the place that sells insurance? And I was so upset, and then I just did all my work super fast to prove everyone wrong, but I was, like, channeling so much anger. And I was just like, you know what? The anger actually made me work better, and I was just like, this is weird. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if that's normal, so maybe I am a Sith person. Roger, Roger. I don't know, Roger. Roger. Amber, you're you're leaving the battlefield. Oh, I don't want to leave the battlefield. Thank you for letting me know. You're welcome. <sighs> I've let you know so I could destroy you. No, you let me know so I didn't jam up the game. No, I like, won't jam up the game. Oh, really? I would just like zip back to where I was supposed to. I only be. need three more kills and it's over. You need seven. I don't know why he enjoys having blue and and 
green lightsabers, like, he should just make his own lightsabers. He doesn't know. He's not a Jedi. He's just some dude that, you know... Really? He's not really uh -oh. a Jedi? No. Then why is he using Jedi lightsabers? Oh. You killed my men! Prepare to die! Oh, what just happened? I just my, cut you down. My organs feel tight. Nah, oh, I can't breathe. Whee! <laughs> Who's the villain now? Oh, we won. Oh, my team just needs one more kill! No, that's not gonna happen. Oh, yes, it is. I'm gonna... It's over! What? Obi Wan wins again! How did you do that? Because you had no troops remaining. Oh. Victory! Oh, General Grievous is crying. Well, he needs to cry because he's terrible at life. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Obi Wan Kenobi is the winner once again. Oh my gosh. Actually, it was really close this time, but in the comment section below, tell us who you want to see Obi-Wan Kenobi or General Grievous battle next time in Star Wars Versus. Yay! Hope you guys had a lot of fun with this video. If you're new to the channel, tell us how you found us, and uh, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, what is that? Click that bell to be notified. To be notified yeah. when more videos arrive on the K-Wings Let's Plays channel! Were you just doing kind of like a songify thing there? Because I was... I was yeah, but that's what I was trying to uh. go for. Yep, so anyway, from us as great big Star Wars fans to you people as Star Wars fans, we hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you with uh, some cool stuff on K-Wings Let's Plays. We're currently playing Spider-Man 2, and uh, we'll be playing Smash Brothers on December 7th, and we're also prob- yeah, we're going to be playing Aquaman on the GameCube, so yeah. come back for that. All right. Outrageous! God bless and happy gaming. See ya!